Hello. What's up Ketchup? Welcome to another digital art tutorial. Hi there, today we are going to discuss more about digital inking. Inking is basically the second step after you have finished your sketch. Let's dig more about my steps in digital inking. But before we start, if you are new to this channel, please support by hitting the subscribe button and ring the notification bell in order for you to become updated with upcoming videos. First step is to set your predictive stroke. Predictive stroke is a tool from Autodesk Sketchbook that allows your line art to become smoother. Basically from the name itself it can predict the strokes of your hand or line art. You can set your predictive stroke up to number 5, but for me number 2 to 3 setting is fine. Next step is to overlap your line, especially when you are dealing with some straight lines. Don't worry about some excess lines. I intentionally doing this in order to use wisely the predictive stroke. Then after this, we need to erase all the overlap or excess lines to have more smooth line art. Now let's have an actual example. I have here a rough sketch of Izuku Midoriya from My Hero Academia. Let's apply our lesson about digital inking. First step is use the predictive stroke. Just follow the lines and don't worry about the overlapped or excess lines. Now, erase all the excess lines. Again, just follow the straight line or the curve of the line that you are dealing with. Finish up your sketches by trying to look for other parts that needs to erase or to improve. 
Again in doing digital inking or other art related stuff, patience is the most important ingredient. If you have any suggestions about other art content or questions, just comment it down below. Just keep on doing art. Because Earth without art is just an A. Until our next tutorial. Stay safe always.